Hey, Nerf Tech here, and I've got a new um, video. It's a Nerf thrifting one. So I'll go over what I've got, review it, and tell you how much I got it for, and tell you if I'm going to mod it or it, leave it in stock form. First, you already see it a Nerf Raider Clear Edition. It's really cool, the Raider. If you don't know what this is, then you probably heard of the Rampage. It looks a lot like a Rampage, except the internals. And it still has slime fire and single fire. And one thing cool about this is it didn't come with the stock, which I'll still try to find, or the drum, but it came with a 12-round Elite magazine, which I thought was a little weird because this is an in-strike, this is an in-strike Elite. Yeah, but I did mod this already, removed most of the locks, the access door, and the clip lock, the lock that jams it most of the time. It does still work, perfect condition, except a few scratches on the plunger guard. Oh, and it is, I got it for $5. Next up, I've got a... Deploy CS6, which still works really good. I mean, wh whoever had this before I got it took really good condition on this because this there's literally no scratches at all, and it did come with the six round mag, which I already have too many, so I might have to get rid of some. But it still deploys fires and I am going to leave this in stock form because when I first went to test this with nerf darts it shot now I don't know if this was ever fired but it fires 40 feet 40 feet yeah 40 foot shooting nerf deployed just something normal you see every day uh, not really because usually the deploy shoots like 15 feet max so that was really cool. I'll fire it at the ground so you can see how hard this does hit. Yeah, so that was really cool. And it was for $3.99, so not really a bad deal. Next, which is the coolest thing, a Nerf Rapid Fire 20. Now, I have to say one thing, I got this about maybe a week or two ago, maybe a week, I think it was two weeks, and I, the whole time, why I haven't done this video, because I've been fixing it. Now, you'll probably see the pump, what happened is the o-ring that attaches to, like, the pump broke off, so I, when I got, when I got a chance to crack into this, the pump I got that fixed, and then I was able to fire it for like 200 shots. Then it uh, it started leaking, and the trigger broke, and then the barrel wouldn't rotate. So then I finally got all those fixed, and I decided instead of having to pump it because it still got the leak in the where the pump gets hold, held. So I'm going to make it into a air powered or CO2 powered um, instead. I've already done it, so when I finish it, I'll show step by step how you do that. But besides that, the rapid fire works perfectly fine. I had finally got the barrel to rotate, and that was really cool. So this is the end of my video. Thanks for watching. Subscribe, like, comment for more. Nerf Tech signing off.